Rodeo is a big deal in Florida, and artist Buster Kenton knew it. Raised in Kissimmee in the 1920s and 30s, Kenton was immersed in Florida's cattle culture. He worked on ranches and attended rodeos where he befriended cattlemen and bull riders who became the subject matter that inspired him to paint. During World War II, he served in Europe in the Army Air Corps and studied with master artists. When he returned home, Kenton attended the Ringling School of Art in Sarasota and Island School of Art in Key West to further develop his art skills. In 1949, Kenton created his most popular design, Cowboy Jake. Wanting to promote the Kissimmee JCs at the JCs National Rodeo in Colorado, the Kissimmee Chamber of Commerce asked Kenton to create a cartoon character that would turn heads. Modeled after Kissimmee cowboy Pete Clemens, Cowboy Jake's broad smile and welcoming demeanor was a symbol of Osceola County's friendliness. Since then, he's become an icon of Florida's cattle culture history as well as the mascot of the Osceola High School Cowboys. For the next 40 years, Kenton's artistic output was prodigious. He painted portraits, murals, magazine and rodeo program covers, storefront displays, and he also tooled leather and carved wood. His art depicts what he grew up with and what he knew best working cowboys, horses, landscapes, livestock, and wildlife. His lush oil paintings celebrated the dexterity of rodeo riders and quiet dignity of Florida cattlemen. Kitten took pains to detail the brawny physiques of bucking bulls and rearing horses to express the beauty and danger of the animals that the cowboys grappled with. A master at capturing mood, he was equally adept at painting serene, moonlit camps as he was at expressing the excitement of cattle drives and roundups. In addition to his oil paintings, Kenton made numerous ink drawings and oil illustrations which are featured in Florida Tales and Trails, a 1987 book about Central Florida pioneer life. In 1989, Osceola's Historical Society and Center for the Arts honored Buster Kenton with a retrospective of his work. Residents brought their paintings from home and the exhibit filled every room in the gallery. In 1991, Buster Kenton passed away at the age of 70. Today, the Buster Kenton Room in the Osceola History Center is a prominent tribute to his artistic legacy and enduring influence on Kissimmee. Considered the Dean of Florida Cowboy Art, Kenton was a pioneer of the genre in this state and many of Buster Kenton's works still decorate the walls of homes, restaurants, offices, and museums throughout the county. His paintings and sketches do more than capture a time and place in Florida history. They are a testament to a way of life that still brings pride to many residents of Kissimmee and Osceola County. Because of his paintings that championed Florida's cowboy culture, an integral part of Osceola County's identity, the Florida Division of Arts and Culture is pleased to induct Buster Kenton into the Florida Artists Hall of Fame.